Okay, this is Sam Dog, and today we are demonstrating what not to do when leash training your dog. So right now, Sammy is actually walking me. Like if we walk, see she's pulling me. This is a dog walking a person like this, right? Okay, so she probably smells an animal or something like that. So the, the way that we train them, and our dogs are hardly ever on leashes, is I wrap the leash around my arm like this so I can get it shorter, okay? And I loop it, and I loop it like this until she is within a foot of me because you want your dog to be trained to heal like this. And when I say heal, she should not be pulling me. She should be at a, dis at a distance like this. She's still pulling me. So then we stop and I say heel. And there's slack. And we say walk. So now I am, well, okay, she's not doing that. So now I am walking the dog. She's not on a leash very often. So now I'm walking the dog. She is not walking me. Heel. So she knows. There's just too many scents out here, but she knows. So when I loosen it, heel, heel. When I loosen it, we should be able to just walk like this normally. Leash training is hard, especially with dogs that are never really on leashes. But anyway, that'll give you a little glimpse on leash training. You heel. Heel. And so she knows that she's not doing it like she's supposed to. Then we start walking and she should walk with me, not walking me. She should be walking with me like this with a little bit of give to the leash. So we practice this on gravel roads when they're puppies for all the way until they're like two years old. Sammy's four, so she should know better. But so now I am walking the dog. She's not walking me. We have neighbors that can't walk their dog because they pull like this. If I give her, so now I am walking her. She's not walking me because they will take off after something and drag you down the road. So that is definitely a skill that most dogs need to learn how to walk on a leash. Good demonstration, Sammy. Good girl.